And when bears sprint, they're sprinting to kill, right? They don't sprint for no reason, to my knowledge. Oh god, oh god, oh god, it's happening. Okay, uh, I'm back. I'm recording this uh, in the morning, um, as opposed to my normal times. Uh, hopefully I'll have more energy this way. Um, it's a couple hours before my stream. Uh, I think I'll prefer this over late night recording when I'm dead. Right? So we'll see. Alright, uh, we killed a bear, right? In my fury, we, we murdered a bear. I think if I can find enough materials... In fact, let's just, while we warm up by the fire and cook, let's go ahead and get some sticks off this tree. We gotta multitask the best we can. Um, I don't know, I don't see a lot of branchy leaves on this large, dude. <clears throat> Unfortunately. Uh, anyways. The plan is to mass murder bears. Or get killed by them. Right? How's my temperature? Uh, we're okay. Yeah, the plan is to kill bears. Um, I figure if I were to kill a couple of bears, then I'll definitely have enough food to go explore or cover some ground. I'm tired of relying on the ruins to be alive. I think that's a valid strategy, but I gotta incorporate the murder of bears. Um, the plan is... To snipe them at a distance, so I'm going to need a lot of spears. And hopefully not aggro them. The The further we are from water, the more dangerous it's going to be to try this. What can I make with ropes? I don't think I can make anything useful, can I? <clears throat> I have no idea. But I'm going to use this to make a bunch of spears. Uh, if only we had a bag. A bag would make a big difference in all this. But uh, I don't think that's going to happen. Um... I like what past me did, right? It looks like we built a, a lot of spears. I don't know how loud this music is. Hopefully it's not too loud. I have no idea. All right, all our food is done. Uh, let's go ahead and chow down here before I take more damage. And uh, I think we already got our fur coat or what I could make at the time. Uh, a few people suggested I make pelts. I get you, but like for, until hunger is not an issue, uh, I got to eat the fat. The fat is so good at restoring our... Our saturation, right? But if I'm going to be murdering bears, I should have plenty of food anyway. So, maybe I can follow the plan, right? Maybe I can make some pelts, uh, and and maybe make some some bags out of possible uh, reeds we get, as like uh, hunter bags instead of regular bags. Or I could cure it for fur, right? As, um, and wear that over my regular clothes to get even more warmth. Um, and that'll extend... That hopefully will reduce my hunger. Because apparently being cold increases hunger. I don't know if it's like a threshold where you're just getting this hungry at this time. Right? Or if it's like a, an amount, like a percentage increase over over how cold you are. Either way, being warm is good. Um, that way I spend less time trying to warm up or whatever. Uh, I say I make more spears, dude. You might be like, hey, is it that unwise? Ah... Uh, Maybe. But uh, I feel safer having a lot of spears finding bears. Because it'll give us more chances to recover our spears. Right? As they move around uh, away from the ones that we threw. Where's that knife? Did I have a knife? I thought I had a knife and I thought I like placed it. But... Oh, it's right here. Hold on, I screwed up my audio. And my... my speakers are worn out. And the jack I plug in my headset is... Uh... I gotta jiggle the cable. I'm at jiggle, jiggle the cable status with my, my headset. You know what I mean. We've all been there. Power cable, headphones, something. Usually, usually Mac charger cables. You know what I mean. I'm on jiggle the cable status with this headset. I gotta get a new one eventually. 
<clears throat> I hate jiggle the cable status. It's the worst status, dude. As a streamer, it's a it's uh, uh, pretty distracting uh, to be in that state. All right, let's do one more. The thing is, we got to move our spears or leave our stuff behind. Uh, like, I could probably eat, leave the axe here. And I'll probably just place these stones as storage. And maybe I could store the grass in my campfire along with this leather. Actually, I, I guess I could carry the leather since I know I'm going to put it up. Um, we'll see. Yeah, people suggested to use the campfire as storage. That's a really good idea. I, I, I have been doing that when, when necessary. Um, so I will remember that. This won't burn, right? No. Alright, uh... I guess I'm good to go. I think our initial investment... Uh, these will burn, right? The leather won't burn. Alright, let's take the knife. I don't want to take the axe as like a, a last-ditch self-defense thing, but... I mean, I'm, I'm already dead if that happens. Alright, I'm not going to survive. Okay. Let's try to find a bear near the water so I have somewhere to fall back. Otherwise, I have to snipe him. Maybe I'll fall back to make more spears. There's a bunny. But we're hunting until we have a large amount of food. I already feel pretty good because we made um, the leather outfit. <clears throat> so I think I'm going to record one hour at a time. Uh, I think that's how I'm going to do this. And since I'm recording in the morning this time... Uh, maybe if I, you know, need more time, I can record again tonight. And hopefully I can avoid that five-hour session of repeated death. <clears throat> I'm glad, I'm glad you guys, uh, are positive, uh, for the most part. Um, I feel very fortunate. Because I have been, I don't know, you guys are very nice, I'll, I'll say. We'll, we'll leave it at that. Well, let me expose this now so I know where the meat is. I gotta take this meat back. Oh, I shouldn't be sprinting, man. That's the problem with, like, hunting with this many spears. I'm I'm here to, like, murder a bear. Not a little guy. I wonder if I should leave behind some spears until we scout out a location of a bear. Right? That might be more prudent. Um, also, what happened to those bear bones? Did I just not get them? I suppose I left them under the water, right? I remember that we killed them in the water, I think. I I might confuse my my normal playthrough with this one. I've been playing a lot of Vintage Story on my stream. To the point where I feel like maybe I should dial it back. Because I do consider myself a variety streamer. Um, I don't really want to stick to one game at all times. I have games that I go back to frequently, though. Right? And Vintage Story is one of them. Sometimes I take breaks from it, though. Uh, okay, let's do this. And, uh, I don't think I want to cook it yet, but we still have heat. Ah, whatever. You know what? The grass we could pick up. Maybe we could get the grass back from this. Let me check. Yeah. So I say we just do this. All right? I don't want to turn it to a campfire because I can't recover it, right? But I'll just sit on the ground like that. I feel like, uh, like an idiot doing that, but... <laughs> what can I say? Right? Uh, I do want to make a bone knife eventually, but since I know I'm going to be picking up leather and, and scraps like that, I don't mind taking it with me. Let me leave behind one more spear. And we're going to scout the location of a bear to murder. Right? Got another bun, which is nice. I think I see something to my left, but let me focus on this target. Look at that variance. There's a baby bun to my left. Baby buns have no meat, only bones. They're all bone. I can barely see this guy. Come on. Yeah, the variance is uh, what's getting me there. Alright, two red meat. Not bad. I have a bad feeling about this. Let me take a look around from this side before I creep up and get my kill. My paranoia is at extreme when I play Cold Guy. The adventures of Cold Guy are all the same thing. Me stomping around the snow. Um, at this point, I feel like you guys are just listening to someone's blog post 
as they fail over and over repeatedly. Um, I enjoy this, right? It feels like uh, that one in a million chance that someone of my ability makes it uh, would be very fun. But uh, I don't know. <laughs> I appreciate you guys that enjoy this, is all I could say. Uh, thank you. All right. And, you know, I'll, I'll do my best not to let, like... Whenever I get in that, like, downward spiral, I let things affect me more than I should. And I'll obsess over things and, you know, like, talking about the... Uh, uh, a dislike, even though the ratio isn't bad and things like that. I'll try to contain myself and not be a Debbie Downer, a negative Nancy, right? Complaining Carl. Uh, 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 pitable Pete. I don't think that's a word. You get the you get the drift, right? Okay, we're stacking up on meat. Um, I don't. I refuse to change being blackguard because I love playing blackguard and I love the that I'm always hungry at the start. But um, I've been discussing this on my stream whenever I play Vintage Story. I'm considering lowering the damage modifier. Because even on, on the game where I'm not having a cold start, just normal, you know, hardcore permadeath, I realize that that damage modifier, while I like it for the early game, making dangerous stuff out of like a fox and a, a, a bighorn, um, the damage you take even with steel makes steel, it makes steel armor like really garbage. Right? Because there's a lot of debuffs associated with heavy armor. I'm not seeing any bears. Why is it that when I'm ready to, like, murder the bears, I can't find them? The moment I let my guard down, that's when they're going to show up, right? But, um... Yeah, I, I've kind of decided that... I think I might remove that. I want to I want to hear what you guys think. Am I being a coward? Am I giving up? Um... It's just, like, genuinely, like, uh... Even with, like, steel... Uh, a nightmare sloth or a uh, a bear will basically do enough damage that you barely win if you're landing attacks. Because I I, the, I ex personally experienced this the first time I ever got to Steel Age, right? And I was playing with that 150% damage modifier on a perma death guy. Um, and I was like I was very disappointed with the armor, and then uh, a few nights ago I tested it, right? I I tested it in a creative world, and I confirmed that, yeah, it's really bad. So, I'm thinking I'm just going to lower the 50% damage. I hope you guys aren't too uh, turned off by that, but... I think if I'm ever... Let's say on the off chance I live long enough to, to like, go dangerous exploring on this character. Um... Just having that on top of everything else, uh, I don't think I want to anymore. Plus, I want to have fun, and uh, I think I, I'm overly harsh on this game's combat because of the self-imposed settings I have, right? Like, I'm not looking at it in a realistic way. Damn, dude. That one might have fell in the pit. This bunny's very annoying to hunt. Try and, oh, hope it's not a deep pit. That's not even a pit. Way higher. Look at this variance, dude. I hate it. There we go. In terms of sniping, it becomes a big problem. Bunnies are really annoying because they... I guess gazelles are probably the most annoying to hunt. Right? Because they run so far from you. And I feel like the RNG I have, no matter how good... I, I don't know if it's worth it, man. Look at how much... Uh, we got three meat. And look at how much hunger I wasted just walking around. That's gonna... I'm gonna need a lot of bears. <laughs> I wonder if the next compromise I gotta make on difficulty is gonna be, uh... Giving up Blackguard. I don't wanna. I wanna be a Blackguard. I like the idea of... Of just being like a soldier out of their element in the elements. Right? How did we get here, though? I don't really have a lore explanation to that. I don't think there is a good explanation for the sheriffs, right? It's just like... 
We just came back because we got to rebuild the world. I remember reading some of the story stuff that's on the website, which I found interesting. It's a little cryptic. I think it's like overly cryptic, but I think that's the vibe they're going for. And when you're cryptic like that, a lot of that leaves it to the user's imagination, right? Yeah, this is bad. All I did was get half a light, half a stamina bar only to just walk out and kill four rabbits, three rabbits. That's not good, dude. Did I already start the fire? Huh. Alright, I hope you guys like uh, whatever instrument this is because that's what we're listening to for a few minutes. Alright, calm down. Um, I think that... I think that the hunger... Hey, you're starving, taking damage should be less intrusive. I wonder if there's a mod to, like, make it quieter or less often. Um, I do think that, like, players of Vintage Story in Minecraft have a habit of forgetting to eat. I see it all the time. I do it all the time uh, on stream. I think it's a meme. EAT! Right? They type in all caps in chat. EAT! Or in the comments. You gotta eat more. Um... It is something I see it uh, quite often. So maybe that's why they're so annoying with it. Eat this. All right, while we uh, sit here, we have full temperature? Yeah. Uh, the clothes that we have now is a little better. I kind of want to climb up there, but I, I got to make a ladder if I want that. I think we get more reach with tools. All right, we get a little bit more reach. I don't know if the axe would be better for this, but let's poke at every bush and hope for the best. I mean, we have a fair amount of sticks right now. Um, I think I'll chop down that tree and just see what branches we get out of it, since I need more firewood anyhow. It's going to cost the stamina to do that, of course. But it is what it is. Let's go. Get some mead. We're gonna have to leave this area. After we eat this, I say we go for a walk, at least heading north. I'll figure out where north is in a moment. <clears throat> I prefer using the smoke. I, f I have a hard time looking at the clouds sometimes. Depends on the angle I'm looking at them from. <clears throat> uh, I do have to stream in a little bit, so... Feels kind of rushed. But I figure if I record about an hour and a half, hopefully things go well. Right? Because that's, that's how long I want a, a video to be, about an hour. That's the sweet spot for my encoding. Where it's not, like, uh, overly intrusive. <clears throat> Got to put up a thing here. Oh yeah, I, I forgot. Someone, someone gave me a good tip about how I eat. That I should only eat after one tick of hunger. I completely forgot about that. Right, I think that's what it was. Someone, you guys give, have been giving me good ad advice. You might want to, you might have to repeat that every now and then. Because I do read them, and then I, I give a heart to the comments I read. Um, I Someone said, uh, if I eat after every tick of starvation, after one tick of starvation, I'll have a temporary buff. And that'll extend my, my food span, right? So once I have a bag, I'll be more than welcome to do that. But uh, I'll have to sacrifice inventory right now. Right now, I'm, I feel like since I don't need the pelt currently, I feel like I should get rid of the pelt. Because until I'm comfortable with inventory and hunger, I'm not going to cure the pelts. And right now, I've already made my shirt and pants that have, like I think, like two Celsius warmer than my starting set. So I think um, I'm just going to sack that. I kind of want to keep the bones because it'll, it'll make useful stuff, but I think what I'll do is I'll probably leave behind the knife and I'll just make a bone knife and a bone axe and I'll leave those two behind. Um, and then I'll just toss out the bones I have. I think that's what I'm going to do. That's the plan. So, uh, let me go split these logs first. I forgot about that food thing. I'm glad I remembered. Um, yeah, I appreciate I appreciate the tips. Sometimes, like, I already know 
like I might already know, but like it's okay to just tell me. Right? Because maybe I'll forget. Because I do forget stuff all the time. Um, so don't worry about about it too much. Yeah, I find that it feels different. Like reading YouTube comments versus a stream. Right? In a live stream, when people keep telling me stuff I already know, it does kind of uh, get to me a little bit, right? But on YouTube comments, it feels different. So I don't, I don't mind people being like, oh, this, just in case, you know, maybe I forgot or maybe I'm just never knew. If I already know it, don't worry about it. Like I might say, yeah, I knew that. But uh, hopefully you guys aren't like offended by that. Um, <laughs> I don't know why you would be, but you never, I don't know. People seem to get upset about different things, right? Including myself. All right, get, I could just carry this instead of ready logs, right? But um, because of the nature of freezing to death, I'd rather just have them on the ready, to be honest, right? So I think I'll just redo it uh, for better. I can't put this down for some reason. Why? Oh, so I don't have it selected because I'm an idiot. That's why. All right. I like that we have a camp here. All right. So I might leave this behind. All right. Let's grab this meat. I'll save this meat. Let's make a bone knife and let's make a bone axe. I hope I don't regret carrying the axe. I could just make the axe later and just use a stick for it. But I'd rather just make a sturdy bone one. Um, and then whenever we decide to hunt, I'll just put it down on the ground. Right? And uh, I don't know if we'll come back to this camp. We might, depending on how soon we find a uh, a target to hunt. Right, right now, all I care about is food and ruins. But I want to practice slaying bears. Right? I don't know if I should stream or sorry, video record me practicing slaying bears, but I'm tired of them. And I want you guys to see the process of like, is it worth getting good at killing bears? I mean, it sounds like it should be, right? But we'll find out the hard way. And if you never, I mean, honestly, if I would just nerd pull or build something, I'd probably be fine. Like I noticed like in, I don't really watch Minecraft to be honest. Uh, I don't know. I never got into watching Minecraft uh, streamers or, or YouTubers. Um, but I have seen Minecraft speedruns, right? Just out of curiosity. And I noticed that they would like pillar up and like kill something like a golem, like an iron golem or something. So, I mean, if they do it, should I do it? The answer is no. I refuse. Did I make two knives, dude? No. I'm not going to do it. I don't have any logical reason other than I'm stubborn and I refuse to like dial back uh, difficulty. Okay, we're going to take these with us. Right? So we have our tool making. We have our, our snack. I'm not going to eat this until we get one tick of hunger because apparently we'll get a buff. Right? So I guess we'll take one. Hold on. Let me arm myself the way I like. Let's put this. Oh, I'm paused. There we go. Is this how you do this? I, I, weird. I don't know why, but I imagine that I, I did this without pausing and without bringing up the menu, but maybe I just always done it. What a, what a strange feeling. Is this what... Do I, am I getting, like, early onset uh, Alzheimer's? Like, a, <laughs> early onset dementia? What's wrong with me? Okay. I, I'm still doing it. There we go. Uh, to be fair, like when I play other games with things that are similar, I tend to like combine them in my mind. All right, let's take these with us too. I'm not going to put anything on my offhand. Oh, the fire starter. Shoot. There's just so many things we got to carry, dude. Damn. All right, we got to put up another spear. I don't want to leave these spears behind. The fire starter is absolutely necessary, though. Yeah, I'm gonna have to forget the the axe. Feels bad. All right. Well, if we find a bear, I'll just come back here to grab our spears. Depends on how far it is. Oh yeah, which way is uh south? This is north, and this is south. 
I think this is the direction I came from, though. Oh, I'm forgetting my wood, too. Wow. Yeah, this... I really need inventory, huh? How about, how about instead of uh, just starting to head southward for, for normal travel, I could just try to look for some ruins nearby. But I could create a food situation. Hmm. Hard choices, man. Hard choices. It's the spears, right? I... Well... I mean, I gotta take the wood. It's an important thing, so... Obviously, the choice is clear here. I could always make another knife. But let's just take what we can, wood-wise. Alright. Southward. We're already getting cold pretty quick. It's a chilly day. I I see. I think I see water uh, uh, on the other side of that uh, trader. I see trees that way, so that's good. Um, it's not the direction I want to go in, but if there's a bear near water, I want to try to murder it. And until we have bag technology, there's a bunny there. It's very nice. Let's try to get that bunny. I'll have to go back to our camp, but... Food is food. And if I'm holding one stake on me, let's make it worth holding one stake, right? Can I crouch for stealth? The answer is no. I hate hunting bunnies. But not as much as gazelle. I'll j I just gotta tell myself, at least it's not a gazelle. Can you creep up on creatures? See, I wish I had this in my other file. There we go. I wonder if he could sneak up on him. He's not sprinting yet. That'd be interesting. I mean, it feels like it's working. I've never done this before. I never crept. I wonder if that'll function on bears. Like, even when I hit it, it didn't react. <laughs> Gets next to bear. Snaps its neck like solid snake. Yeah, right. It goes the other way. Alright, since... Oh, holy shit, I can't carry this. This is cursed. I just need more stuff. More space, you guys. Right? It's it's really cursed. Is there another bunny nearby? Usually there, there's a couple. Now what? Do I go back and cook this? I don't think I have a choice. Alright, this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to leave some wood here so I can find this spot easily. I'm going to leave the knife... We're going to go back and cook this, and we'll pick up this stuff on the way back. Is this worth it? I... I think being Blackguard is, uh... Showing how difficult this is. Right? Difficult and tedious. I hope you guys are... are... going to accept this. Oh, well. Let's go ahead and cook this steak up. Um, I'll try the eat when the, the tick happens. I, I don't know if I'll notice the difference. I hope I notice it. Because if I notice it, then it's defi definitely going to be worthwhile. But uh, a lot of this, until we get bags, it's going to be hard to uh, make progress. That's for sure. I don't mind warming up a little bit, so it's not too bad. We buy these bones and leather. Should be enough wood. You know, I set my house on fire on my other file, on my stream game. And uh, I don't know how it happened. Because so I was doing it like this, but I, I somehow set on fire, like, the background. It was like a vine. And I, I think I set a vine on fire. But I can't set bones down. I wonder if it's worth creating storage using the grass. Because grass is such a premium, I really don't want to do that, though. Alright, we got our first debuff. Let's see how long this lasts. Honestly, I might... I don't know, right? Like, uh, the trade-off in... I wonder how long this buff lasts. I wonder if it's worth the, the trade-off of inventory space. Maybe it is, maybe it isn't. Let's save this last log. Put this last log away. 
We warmed up. Let's go get our stuff. I actually left some firewood back there, didn't I? I don't know how much I left, so... We'll find out the hard way. <laughs> what? I see. I feel like the way I play is so stupid. Right? I'm going to have to figure out a minimum amount of spears I need to hunt the bear away from water. But the more I have, the more comfy of an experience it is, because I could just keep sniping it from a distance until we we down it, right? It's fairly cold. I'm already... At, I didn't see if I, I reached temperature, but it feels pretty cold today. I think I should head towards that tree line, though, even though it's not the direction I want to go in. Let's go that way, since I know I could get more wood that way if I have to. I don't need the bomb. Take the knife, though. And we'll leave... We'll leave this behind, I guess. Don't worry, I know what I'm doing. <laughs> 32 it is. Let's go towards that tree line. It looks like it's by some water. I can't really tell. Maybe it is, maybe it isn't. This food buff seems to be pretty smart, dude. <coughs> maybe you guys can pay attention better than I can. But it looks like it's worth eating a piece of meat uh, after one starvation tick. Let's hope the devs, Iron or whatever his name is, doesn't decide to, like, change that. It's a valid strategy. Don't, don't change this. All right, please have bag making technology, right? If we can make a bag, it's going to help us a lot. Let me make sure to secure the area first. I want to make sure I'm not going to get murdered by a deranged bear. Seems okay. Unless I need deranged bears. All right, what do we got in here? We got dirt and looks like clay. Stones. Stones that are the wrong type. But there's more of them than this one, so I'll put these down. Yeah, there's like nine. Unfortunately, I can't do much with that dirt. Uh, sometimes there's multiple jugs, right? So let's dig down a little bit and see if we can find another... another jug. I think if it's a polished rock, I can just punch through it. There's bony soil. Not a bad idea to try to pan it, but I think we'll do that once we're ready to like look for extra resources. All right, I don't think there's going to be another jug. I'm starting to take hunger now. Yeah, I think it, I do think it's worth it doing that. I think if I keep doing that with a couple of meats, it'll definitely expand my. Uh, I think these had seeds or something. I really don't know where to dig for this one. There's two ruins. There's one over there. Unless this is all the same one. Is this bauxite? Nice. Somebody told me that there's never something in bauxite. Ore? Like, bauxite never has ore, maybe? Very tempted to just make a shovel for this. Right? And then just try to see what kind of... At this point, I'm pretty desperate for a bag. Right? Um, so I really don't mind trying for it. I don't know if this is all one ruin. It looks like it is to me. I still haven't done my homework of, like, researching uh, ruins. I feel like it's about to change anyways, right? Because uh, I think on the, I've mentioned this before, but on the previous devlog, I, I want to say I read that somebody's working on ruins. Right, while they're going on their trip or whatever. Or that's their next goal, eventually. Maybe we'll get some bonus sticks while we're here. Is this pine? It is, it's pine. Now, if there's resin, I think I, I can make a crappy armor. At least. Um, oh, yeah. Why don't I make a crappy armor? I should have done that with all that firewood, dude. I don't know if it'll save me from a bear with our HP, right? I think we need at least 25 HP. Annie has to hit our, armor, our armored body. But I think if that were to happen... Uh, we would survive. I should have done that. I'll do it with what I have now. Right? Because it might it might save us. And uh, this, this first set of armor doesn't have penalties either. I completely forgot about it. I wonder if anybody was like, Make armor! 
Right? You're right. I forgot. I'm sorry. Uh, yeah, it doesn't add any hunger. Right, our hunger rate is still 155. Um, I don't want this pine cone, sorry. We have a good amount of sticks, so I'm not going to bother getting more. Hopefully find more ruins. I'm very tempted to make a shovel and just start a fire there and just dig. Not seeing anything. Hold on. I'm going to cheat and pause it so I'm not freezing and starving. I'm just kind of... I got to make this a habit, maybe. If there's a bear around here, I do want to try to slay it. Right, lure it to the water and do it that way. Why, why is it that when I'm ready, right? I resolve myself, right? They brought me to the brink of quitting. I think there's there might be flint in those rocks. Uh, they brought me to the brink of quitting, you know? And then I resolve myself. I'm ready. Let's fight. Where are you? They're going to spawn behind me, right? Now that I'm looking for them. When I let my guard down, that's when they show up. I'm ready, though. Okay. Uh, I'm going to... There's like a cave there, over there. But, uh... I'm gonna... You know what? I'm gonna do it. I might regret this, right? But it'll let, like, small animals spawn around me while I do this, hopefully. I'm, I'm gonna make a fire over there and a shovel. Oh, there's already our small animal right there. So once we take this hunger damage, I'll eat this meat, right? But what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make a fire near these ruins i might grab some of these blocks and just set them aside and build a campfire on top of them and we're just going to hang out there and warm up while we dig and while i cook that rabbit that's the new plan um is it a good plan it's an ends plan we'll say that much i don't know what kind of stuff that ruins has i know with my luck it's going to have like seeds or something <laughs> something lame I cannot see this rabbit. The bloom is blinding me. There it is. Let's eat this. All right. We're following that strat. That's a great tip, dude. That's probably one of the best tips I had to play this sort of way. Right? Let one starvation tick hit and then and then utilize the the little buff you get. The thing is is like I'm doing this in extreme settings. Please if if somehow a dev sees this and it says, oh, that's too much. No, it isn't. Because this is being used in an extreme situation. Don't screw over, like, normal players just because some hardcore player is, like, utilizing video game mechanics. That's what happens when you when you start playing this way, right? Uh, don't punish regular players because I, uh, some idiot is doing something extreme. But uh, we'll see. We'll see what they do. I gotta punish these regular players, right? Oh my gosh. I didn't even see this. Look at it. I'm so glad we came back. This bunny brought me back, dude. The bunny brought me back. Grass. Clay, too. Mm, the clay is so frustrating. Let me think about this. I say... I say for the clay, I might make it... Since we got all this bonus grass, I'm going to make a campfire for storage purposes. And I'm going to store this dirt and clay here. I don't know if I'm, like, overdoing... Overdoing it, because I want to make two new fires. But we have a good amount of grass. We have 22 fires right now. I'm going to do it. I'm gonna make a a bonus a bonus uh, fire, All right? And I'm just gonna do it as storage. Watch the next update. We removed the ability to store things uh, in fire pits. It's we decided it's too overpowered. Store this dirt. I don't want this. I like this, but I don't want it. 
There could be more, man. What if there's more beneath these steps? Nah. Alright, let's leave this clay behind. Alright, let's go. Let's make a proper fire over here, because that's where I'm going to dig. And we'll make a shovel. I'll probably just put it over here. Um, this could be a mistake, right? We could end up dying. Uh, somebody said they lost their investment after the first cold guy dies. I understand that feeling. Don't You don't have to force yourself to like watch this stuff. Alright. Also, I do apologize for being such a like dramatic... I don't know, guys. I'm having a hard time. It's just like a combination of being exhausted, bad day, so on, so forth. I shouldn't make videos like that, but I, I didn't want to like lose a week of making videos just because like it came out bad. Right? Uh... Oh, yeah, let's make our fire before we start doing this. I guess I'll make it on top of this thing. Right? I like this spot. Did I not bring my wood? Dude. Let's go back. <clears throat> I really do like this uh, this food strat. I think that's very helpful. For the way I'm playing, that's gonna it's kind of a game changer. It's a little bit difficult to pull off in terms of like when it my inventory, right? But um, it's worth it. I think the trade-off is definitely worth it, especially as Blackbird. Right? That uh, all that food I had earlier, man. I if only I I remembered. Right? It's okay. I remember now. At the very least. Bird. Okay. Put this up. Put this. Uh, I'll keep one spare on me just in case. Leave our logs. Make it a little outdoor camp here. Let's start digging. Now, this is more for exploration purposes, right? To see if we can find, whenever we see this kind of ruin, maybe I can know where to dig. Kind of how, like, we know where to dig for the, the square one. It looks like it's probably just surrounding. Maybe it's a downward staircase. I remember a long time ago when I first played this game, I found one that had a basement. I never really found one again. I wonder if this is a basement one. Right? So this might be a major find for us. Uh, it gets down to quartz. Maybe this isn't a basement. Oh well. I don't know which way to dig. I remember we saw more ruin in a different direction. Which way? Was it this way? is this way. I don't know if it's... Well, it looks like it is part of it. Let's dig down and see if it's... There's bony soil here. This might be some sort of grave. Right? It's really hard to tell. I don't know which way to dig. The food's probably done. How cold am I? I'm pretty cold, too. Too bad the fire won't, like, radiate towards us. Okay, we're ready to eat this. Um, don't really want a shelter here, but... I feel like I'm just going to block, obscure my vision and then get myself killed somehow. Let's just put this over here for now. That orange sticks out like a sore thumb in this area. It's pretty nice. Alright, we could dig down in this area, but let's go dig around this, uh, this stuff. Maybe... It'll be more promising. Right, I don't know if we should dig this way. Let me try it. If it's just uh, more bauxite sand, I don't think we should go that way. I think this might be an unrelated ruin. Because it's not connected in any way. Or maybe it's like a church and... There's a slab here. God, that... I, I guess I haven't been in snow, but does snow, like, kick up that much, like, snow dust? Like, is that a thing? 
Like, I know, like, in an avalanche it does that. But right here it feels like a bit much. I don't know. Maybe I haven't been in crazy snow, right? I'm, I'm a Californian. I'm a filthy Californian. Right? So I, I haven't been in, like, true cold. I do live in the high desert, right? So it does, it does get cold. Okay, let's do our one tick starvation trick. Um, so it does get cold enough to snow here, but only just barely. Right? Only just barely. Yeah, man. I don't think I'm going to find anything. All I find is a uh, bony soil, unfortunately. I think I'm just wasting my time, dude. I'm sure somewhere here is a is a vessel. There always is at least one vessel. But I don't know where to look. Right? We're not we're not finding it, man. I wonder if it could be beneath the bones. All right, shovel's dead. That's my try. Right? I'm going to poke through this. No, it's just quartz. What a waste of my energy. I think we should go try to hunt something, though. Right, I don't think we're going to need a shelter, but... This will make it really obvious where it is. Should have made that as a base in retrospect. Alright, uh... Let's get our spears and let's go find something to hunt. I need, I want to have like one meat in hand. Uh, do I see anything around here? Just the ruin we came from. There might be something over there. We haven't really looked. The water's over there, so if we find a bear, we could try to utilize that. I don't see any bunnies. Our buff is about to run out, right? Let's go, let's go towards that water and see what's up. I'll make more spears if I need them. I only have nine stones, but we have a deposit of stones back there. I guess if you're watching in a playlist, it's an easy thing to binge, but right? But like, I feel like if you're waiting for the next episode and then this is what you get, you're not going <laughs> to come out satisfied. I got to stop worrying about this. Just, just record. Record and play the game. Stream guy. Video guy. Let's go. It's a clean murder. Okay, we have something to cook, so I'm happy about that. The bear has heard my plan, dude. They're conspiring against me. I do want to bust this up. I don't know if leaving the carcass behind blows their spot, their respawn, but... Let's be th thorough and bust that up. All right, I'm going to walk towards this water and hope for a bear. It's probably more copper, right? Right there. Yeah. You know, we did find that clay. And we do have grass. Just saying. We would have to sacrifice about 11 or 12 of our grass. Let's see how close we could get to him. See, the moment I got up, because I, I was holding crouch, right? So when you hold crouch, you, you stick to ledges. Right? The moment I dropped down to let go of crouch, it run away. So I think you can... I didn't know about a stealth mechanic. Right? Apparently there's like a stealth mechanic to this. That might help us with our bear hunting. Maybe that was obvious to all of you guys, but I actually did not know this. Can I not pick up spears if I'm... Okay, there you go. Let's get this guy. Ugh. I'm gonna get this carve first. Oh, was it a baby baby bunny? Oh man. I'm sorry. I was like, there's so many of them out here. What the I see how it is. No bears, but assassination through a temporal portal. Medium activity too. Ah oh, shoot, I already scared him. This ledge is going to screw me anyways. I only need one more hit on him. The variance angers me. 
I want to sprint towards it so bad. I'm missing a spare on it. Where did I leave it? Did it break? Damn. Well, I don't know. Let's continue the hunt. I did not change the, the aiming at all. That's just how the variance is. I still find the hunting satisfying. Like, this is the sort of, like, RNG that I don't mind because it's class-related. Right? I do think that maybe it could be heavy-handed, especially because of, like, the armor stuff. It becomes ridiculous wearing armor. I think, honestly, I think there's just too many debuffs with the armor. I think it makes armor really stupid. But again, maybe I don't appreciate it because I play with that 50% damage modifier, right? I always come back to that. Uh, you know how I would have done it? The way I would have done it is there are debuffs on armor or buffs. on. Actually, I wouldn't even have debuffs. The way I would have done it is I would have a baseline of effectiveness for armor, but then when you're an appropriate class, you get benefits from it. That's how I would have done it. That way you don't always feel like, like you're debuffed, right? Then it's more like, oh, which, which trait do I want for this? Um, I prefer that sort of stuff over debuffs uh, because it doesn't really feel like a trade-off to me. It just feels like you're being punished to want to be melee. But uh, I think, you know, people make games different ways. And I'm just a player. I don't make games. So I think my opinion is not that of a designer. But I've always been that way. Even with MMOs. Like, as long as it's not unreasonable. Like, genuinely, it's not a problem. Uh, I would much prefer when... I don't like it when MMOs, like, debuff a class to balance another class. To make another class better. Or catch up. They do that sometimes. And I think that's, like, the worst way to do things. Because if it's not actually too bad in terms of being overpowered, and, the, and it's fun, right? And it makes the class feel uh, complete and fun. Don't kneecap a class to improve another class. And I kind of feel like that's what heavy armor is. Right? They kneecap heavy armor to add appeal to the lighter armors. Um, I'm not I'm not arguing about like, real, okay, since we're starving, we're just going to sprint there. I'm not trying to argue about realism sake. Um, it's still a video game. Right? But in real life, I don't care. That's not the discussion I'm having. Right? Uh, I'm talking about just in terms of like, what makes a game fun while you try to balance it? Mm -mm. But I actually, the to be fair though, like the deep one debuff I like about the armor, um, I think it's a little heavy-handed overall, like the amount of debuffs, right? But one that I in particular that I think is interesting and wasn't an obvious one that they did was the reduced healing. Right, reduced healing. You got to sit down take off your armor and then you bandage up you put that shit back on i like that concept right i think that's a good idea but um i don't know again it's just my opinion i i think i i think that maybe i'm speaking from the like i said earlier just from the perspective of someone that's playing permadeath with 50 percent more damage up from creatures so maybe uh I don't realize how powerful a full a full set of plate is, right? Maybe it's like godly. Maybe it's god tier, and I don't realize that because of the way I'm playing. Um, maybe that's all it is. But uh, I lean more towards the side of either improving other stuff versus just debuffing something to add appeal to something else. Uh, I really strongly dislike that. Like, I would have preferred overall bonuses and then class-specific bonuses. Um, 
in my opinion. But, uh, you know, whatever. That's why mods exist, right? Maybe somebody has their own version of, of that stuff, or I can take the time to, to learn to make mods and make my own. That is true. I'm just discussing things, but I think about the game. I feel like whenever I discuss stuff, like when I stream, I feel like uh, people have the attitude of like trying to like instead of like discussing the thing at hand they try to like devalue what i'm saying by being like oh well you suck at the game <laughs> I, I don't know why they do that like i'm talking about something like what i think about mechanics instead of like discussing the nature of like well maybe because of this uh maybe it's better like this or maybe it's because of this right it's always like well you suck I wonder why that happens and i wonder i'm sure i probably do that too like maybe i'm dismissive about a point in some way instead of discussing the the thing at hand I'm, i don't know why i'm taking this wood i gotta decide what i'm gonna do let's warm up a little bit oh, we're already warm uh i think i'm gonna chop down that tree i just don't know where i left my axe i gotta make new spears or i could go get my old ones I could get my old ones. Don't really want to do that. But there were so many of them. And there was also wood already made. I want to press forward. I don't want to go back. I would have to waste another stone. We do have a stone stockpile. I say I make it out of the stone stockpile. Right, and then we'll just make more firewood. Or I could just go with what I have. Right, I did I did waste this uh, chunk of our firewood making the armor. But I'm just gonna grab this stuff and we'll head out. The old base is basically that way. It's not too far. And now that I know this... Oh, there's firewood right here. Oh, no, there's... Okay, let's make an axe. Now, I wonder if this buff makes it so you don't take hunger. Right? Can I sprint during this buff? Should I test it? I don't want to test it. I figure... Oh, man, I think there's a bone nearby, right? Very nice. I like this. Okay, let's go get some mead. Get some wood. I don't actually say wood that way. That's just a habit I have for the stream. If you watch, you know what I mean. If you don't, uh, don't worry about it. A mead. Mm. Let's uh, debranch the top of this one, and we'll chop it down. I don't want to waste my axe power because it's touching all this other stuff. I will use my axe to debranch it. It's got more reach. Stretch our arms a bit. Alright. Give me some mood. Alright, we gotta walk stomp around these these bad lands. What do you call this? Arctic tundra? It's not really tundra. Alright. There was like a cave over here. I'm gonna go look at it. Maybe uh, some bunnies will spawn. Or have spawned. It's a bear cave and still go in there. There's no such thing as bear caves. <laughs> There's no way there would be a bear down there. I kind of want to go back for my spears and start heading north, dude. I think it... Alright, I thought I saw different colored bricks. Alright, um... Which way is north? Okay, I think uh, north is this way. Or south is this way. Right? The wind blows from the west. I think it does anyway. 
I can't tell which way these clouds are moving. I think they're moving to the right. Right? So that's west. So that's north. So we want to go this way. Now, I'm leaning towards going back for my spears right now. Genuinely. What is that? Is that flint? Quartz. Gotta be quartz. The reason why I want to go back for them is... I'll be able to save... I guess all I would bring back is one spear, maybe two. I'll leave behind the axe. I think I see a bunny. Nah. My imagination. I'm really trying to decide... Okay, I see a bunny here, but I don't know. I think it's a baby. Looks like a baby bun to me. Um... I mean, I, the spear's about to blow up. And they have fresh spears back there. I could make metal tools. No, I still I need too many molds to do it. Right, I don't have enough grass. I have enough grass for one firing. And we could make... a bowl, a cooking pot. I don't think I would make a crock pot. While it's nice to store food in, I'm going to be eating the food anyways, and we could keep six meals in a cooking pot. Right? I think we should do it. Because whenever we find rabbits, it'll extend our, our food a lot more. The only problem with this is inventory. I have nowhere to store it. Until I have bag technology, I really shouldn't do it yet. Right? So I need bags to do it, dude. It's already been an hour? Oh my god. This is a boring episode. Yeah, so I think I am going to try to make a crock pot now that I have enough grass. Sorry, a cooking pot and a bowl. But I need a bag, right? The reason why, the, why also we need the storage is we can't just cook one meat. We have to get up to four meat. Oh, I think two meat, right? We need two meat at a time. To eat a proper meal. You can't just cook one meat. You need at least two steaks. Of red meat. I really wish they would give us recipes for uh, bush meat, but... I don't see the big deal. Like, I'll be honest. The food concept is only hard if you play like I am. Or, like, maybe if you're learning the game and it's your first day. Right? Because it, once you know, it's not really a problem. So, like, trying to, like, debuff... See what I mean? <laughs> I, I Like, having, like, a, like, no... I guess you could just say mod the game ends, but... Why? I don't think I should have to mod it for that. We just went in a big circle, didn't we? I like how I'm ready for bear slaying and I just don't see any bears. What a boring episode. So what I think I'll end up doing is maybe I'll record a little bit more. And then I'll just have to edit it down. It was just blog posting. At this point. Uh, but this like food eating technique is a huge, huge step forward in survival. Thank you very much for the advice. All of you guys. Uh, thank you guys for trying to help me and suggesting things and stuff like that. And I appreciate you guys uh, being positive for me. Um, it's okay to be critical and criticize things. right? It's just different when it, it just depends, right? Uh, and someone said that I just got to have a thicker skin. You're right. And you know what? After all these years, I feel like I do. I, I have a pretty decent thick skin, I think, and I've learned to laugh at things versus being uh, insulted by it. But it's just, you. sometimes you just have one of those days, you know? You just have a bad day and things are piled up in a way where you just don't want to deal with bullshit. Well, there's some food over there. Let's get that guy. Although I'm more tempted to fall back to our campfire. Ah, uh, our spear's almost gone. We're gonna have to make a new spear. 
Let's do that. This is a different type of food. It's not going to stack. But there's two of them. Right? So we'll get two meat out of this. And if we're really lucky, we'll get a pelt. Unfortunately, I'm still just going to eat the fat if we get fat. Um, because I don't have storage to start curing the pelts, right? To me, it's not worth it yet. Um, I think if I had abundant food, I don't mind like uh, leaving it in a campfire, right? As storage. But uh, that's my main reason why I'm not going to do it. Okay. So with two spears, I feel like we could you know, chuck one and stab with the other. Ooh, maybe there's more animals that way. Let's see if we could get these towards the water. Right? Let's see how that goes. Oh, somebody just followed me. Because <laughs> I'm recording on OBS and I have the alerts. Or not the alerts, but uh, my info thing. Right? And it just showed that somebody followed me. It's kind of scared me. What is that? Alright. Well, we got some meat here. Delicious fucks. Be a fat boy. Man. Okay, let's just get rid of this stuff. You gotta cook that up, so... I'm a little tempted to just go back to the fires we have, to be honest. Alright, we're gonna have to... Let it get somewhat close. I don't want to really get injured by him. So evasive maneuvers. Spear. Murder him. Now when it does bite me, if it doesn't bite my armor, it does about 25% of my life bar. Right? Because of our modifier. Are you kidding? Man. Skin and bones. Your skin and bones, Fox. Alright, I saw collapsing snow this way, right? Or was it on the other side? Bear. Okay, let's get him. Let's get him. Alright, what we're gonna do is... I gotta make more spears. But I'm gonna get that bear. Let's go fall back to this area because I can, I can put up my food here. I'm kind of tempted to go all the way back to the camp. Right? Oh, there's resin right there too, man. Uh, how should I do this? Well, either way, I got to get ready for my, my stream. So, I think I'll record the bear thing, right? So, I'm going to have to cut it here. And I'll just edit this later. Okay, uh, it's so what? 10 23 p.m um uh, i had paused the recording because i needed to stream um and there was a bear nearby <clears throat> i decided i was gonna hunt it uh but i had to you know I had to pause the stream I, I i thought about this uh while streaming i don't know how it'll reload entities right so i'm, I'm wondering if the bear's gonna vanish or It'll move. I hope it doesn't move, like, near me. That'd be a bad time. Or if it's just gonna, like, respawn. Like, I don't know what happens when you, like, quit the game and then load back in. Will he be in the exact same spot? I assume he'll be in the same spot, but you never know. Weird video game stuff, right? <coughs> Excuse me. Okay. Let's get back in there. Um, I know this is probably very disjointing, uh... Uh, I'll leave this in. Why not? Uh, I The style of video that I like making, um, if I don't do heavy edits, is uh, I kind of just like it being plain. Right? Like, I enjoy funny edits and stuff, but like I kind of like the idea of just not having a bunch of memes pop up and whatever. Um, uh, maybe you understand what I mean by that. But uh, I like simplicity. And I think I'll keep Cold Guy simple. Right. Uh, maybe one time, uh, so sometime sooner or later, I'll, I'll do a fancy guy edit. Okay, let's see what happens. This is our current cold guy. One hour, 21 minutes. Sounds accurate. <clears throat> so, uh, well, I guess it doesn't matter. I, I The way I speak and do commentary is so 
ingrained in me to do it the way I do it when I stream. It's different when you're recording a video. Like, I gotta stop talking directly to you guys, right? In a, in a way that you can't respond to me. It's not like you're next to me here in the room, you know? I gotta stop doing that. That's just like a natural habit I developed over the years. Now, I don't think the game's too loud. Should be fine. <clears throat> Alright, uh, what's going on? Um, the bear is over there. I have one meat with me. I'm kind of tempted to just run back. Grab our spears. I can't bring a lot with me. You know what? Let me confirm the bear first. I could just make these into spears. <clears throat> kind of tempted to do that, but we'll lose all our rocks. I think it was on the other side of this mountain. I wonder how different I sound. Right? A, a whole day has passed. I could have swore we saw it around here. Right? I don't... I want to say it was like down there or right here. It's been a while. For you, it's been seconds. For me, it's been a whole day. I thought it was here, dude. Oh, man. Well... I feel like I'm going to get close to it and then get killed. Let's approach from over here. Just in case. If I die like this, I'm going to be so upset with myself. <clears throat> the bear the bear battles begins today. Right, we've had it with bears. I'm starving. I really like that tip. I could have swore it was here. Oh my god. I wonder if anyone's cringing right now. You're, you're right next to it! Right? Because I don't remember. For you for you guys, it's literally seconds. <laughs> Maybe a minute tops. I don't know where it is. Oh, there he is. I don't know if that's the same one. Let me explore a little bit more. And make sure that there isn't like a bonus bear nearby. That's going to surprise me later. I think that's our guy, dude. Right, there's no bonus bears. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna make a tactical call. I'm just gonna make oh there's another one over there. Guess what? I'm gonna I'm gonna try to kill them all. Alright, let me um decide what we're gonna do. So I'm thinking I set up a new fire here. Maybe by those trees over there. And uh just put all my stuff down. And go kill both those bears. If we get, let's say, 15 meat. And we utilize that that starvation bonus thing. It should last us a really long time. In fact, did it last us so long? Maybe I could start trying to cure those pelts. Right? And then I could make a, like a, a better bag when we finally get the stuff. The thing is, I can't really carry them around. That's the problem. But I say I'm going to go kill the, both of those freaking bears, or at least die trying. Foreshadowing? No. All right, we're we're gonna we're gonna kill them. It's gonna be fine. There's no way a bear is gonna get me. They'll have to cut my head off to do that. Not. Uh, no one's gonna get these references. So I could fall back to get all those spears, but I'm just gonna go for it. Because if we could secure food, uh, we're gonna be a lot better off. I think four stack at a time. I'm going to make eight. And I want to try to lure it to the water. Uh, I wonder if it's easier just to go to that other body of water. Right? As opposed to this one. There's a lot of bumps in the way here. It might be hard to keep interest. And I'm going to have obs uh, obscured vision. Right? My line of sight is going to be broken because of the mountain. So I think we should uh, maybe approach the other side. Right? Maybe it's more flat. It looks more flat to me. But uh, I don't actually know, right? We won't know until we go. We're going to start taking hunger damage while we hunt, though. So what I might do is I might make that fire now. By the trees that we were at. I could make it in the middle of this field, too. But I'd rather just do it by the fuel over there. By the water. Um, I'll do that. For now, let's make these spears. And I'll probably just put them up against this wall. And then we'll grab them when we're ready to go. We're kind of going all in here. I might end up getting this blue guy killed. This cold guy. He'll be isekai to another world and he has to try again. 
He lives a horrible multiple lives. Alright, so I'd, I might put this stone down for the time being, where we're going to make the fire. Because remember, this stone isn't what was around our area. It was more like a stone that uh, we got from a, a storage vessel. Right, so have, carrying this around isn't necessarily wise. Is this all bauxite? Yep. Unlimited bauxite. <clears throat> I should hurry up while we have this bonus. Did I pass the tree already? No, it's way over here. A lot further than I remembered. What is this? What material is this? Boxing. I guess it just had water over it. Or, sorry, ice. <clears throat> what is that? What the hell is this? Oh, I did that. <laughs> right, I forgot about that. My bad. All right, let's make a new fire. I'm being very liberal with our grass. Uh, it's a bit shameful, but whatever. Time is of the essence. And I, I'll be honest, I don't really have a clear memory of where I left all that stuff. So we'll just have to deal with, with my badness. Okay, we'll cook this now. Maybe warm up a bit. I'll make these spears. Uh, I forgot to make them. I was going to make them up there so I could leave them up there. But I guess we can leave this all this grass here. Right, just to make extra room. We want to be able to carry lots of spears. Feels silly to do this, but what can I do? Space is at a premium. Things you do when you're desperate. All right, we could store two more things in that fire. But uh, I don't really have anything that I need to store anymore. Uh, we're going to take the knife and the sticks I got to take with me. So I guess I'll store the sticks. That should be enough fire, right? This up. <clears throat> There's some resin there. Theoretically, I could make uh, some some crappy armor. I'll be honest, I'm not going to make it because it's going to reduce our accuracy a whole lot. Uh, let's leave the sticks here. Oh, let me burn. Sorry. Let me make our spears first. It might be wise to take the sticks in case I got to make emergency spears, but I'm out of materials anyway. So this is all the spear action we have. Okay, put this here. It shouldn't be burning. Alright, let's go. We've had it with bears. So I think I'm just going to run across to the other side. Because luring them to the... Oh, that... I was supposed to go to that tree. My bad. Well, whatever. We made our bed. Now we got to sleep in it. I wonder if anybody noticed that tree. Like, go back! You passed the tree! I'm sorry. Guy, that one guy that noticed, I'm sorry. Okay. Um, there's our guy. I wonder if I can crouch and snipe him. Right? Because it kind of worked with the bunny. I'm going to give it a shot. Let's wait for it to get still so I don't miss. And then we'll have to wait for it to move away a bit so I can recover the spears. Um, it might be better to actually make him chase me and I run this way. Right, if I get him to chase me, I can try to run all the way over there. Is it worth it? I gotta lure him from far away, though. We're, about, we're really gonna sink or swim here, because I'm gonna start taking starvation damage soon. Alright, I think I'm gonna do it from here. Oh shit, dude, it's over. He's already on me. Holy... Is he right behind me? I have no idea. <laughs> okay, we appear to be fine. Uh, we're in trouble. I have to... I'm committing to this, right? I lost where he is. I have no idea where he is. I thought I saw him running. When bears sprint, they're sprinting to kill, right? They don't sprint for no reason, to my knowledge. Oh god, oh god, oh god, it's happening. Whoa, dude! Holy shit! <laughs> okay. Getting those sweet double taps. Okay. Let's recover those spears if we can. 
Okay, they're kind of lined up in a straight line or spears. So let me get away from that. Was stupid close, dude. We should be in the grave. We should be in the grave. Just goes to show you how important line of sight is, right? We almost died because of a lack of line of sight for sure. Okay, he's after me again. Get some good distance away from him. Good, drown. Drown. I think we're going to cook him up now because I want to have that extra food ready so we don't take hunger damage while we hunt the other one. Should I feel bad? Because I don't. Am I a, 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 a psychopath now? Drown. Filthy bear. I hate him. I hate him, dude. Good. And this is terrible. You're, you're, you're committing an atrocity. Great. More atrocities. There's going to be more atrocities from now on. All right? We're going to hunt bears. When I see bear, I'm not going to be like, oh shit, a bear. It's going to be, oh man, food. All right? Let's turn the tables on these guys. Now, I'm lucky that I survived this. All right? I almost got killed by this guy. But uh, I think that's the attitude I'm going to have from now on. Until we're going to come in this into this uh like being afraid of bears and we're gonna come out like a a grizzled hunter all right let's go dude we'll get their buddy after this let's go let's go cook this i think oh yeah uh i'm not gonna save the fat like i know some of you guys want me to do that and i understand i agree i should but um it's just that i really don't have space right now so i just rather eat it for nutrition. We have a lot of spears here. Let's recover these spears. Ah, it feels bad doing this, but... It's just gotta be this way, man. Don't look. If I'm hunting bears forever, guess what? There's gonna be plenty more. Right now, space is a premium, and I gotta focus on that. I gotta focus on our weapons. And our actual food. I hear, a. Uh, a drifter, dude. How? I wonder if there's a, an opening down there. The fact that there was a drifter right away makes me feel like there might be a ruin. <clears throat> okay, that was way closer than I thought. I was hoping to instigate the fight. We were very lucky that there was water. Towards the end, when I was running towards the water, I wanted to jump to get extra distance before I slowed myself down on the water. But there were ledges were there. Right, so I couldn't really time the jump properly. I didn't. I was. I didn't have a speedrunner pixel perfect timing, so I ended up just running into the water. That's when we heard the bear roar. Right. I think if I I kind of let myself sink a little bit instead of like keeping afloat. I think if I didn't let myself sink, I would have died. Right. I felt it. Felt the bear's breath. I felt their claw swipe at my neck. But we lived. All right. So, so you fans of uh, not wasting the fat this way, look away. I don't want you to see this. We're going to need more wood soon. Uh, let's put up some spears while we cook. All right. Um, I will call it here. I, this, could make the, this could make the next episode a death, right? But we're going to call it here because I got I to gotta start uh, uploading this video tonight. Um... This is just the beginning. This is our development arc. All right? We're going to get even with the bears. No, we're going to get uneven. We're going to rule them. They're going to fear us. Oh, shit. It's, it's Blue Guy. He's here. I hear he's really cold and hungry. They want to wear my skin and eat my flesh. That's what the bears are going to think. It's over for them. This is just the beginning. All right? We might die a couple of times. It might take a while. But we're going to cut our teeth murdering bears and we're going to become powerful. We're going to get so many bears and we're going to head south. And we're going to find a beautiful oasis of warmth. And we could grow crops. We could build a nice home. Right? We're going to live in comfort. We just got to make it. All right. Thank you guys for, for watching. I appreciate you guys uh, sticking with me. Um, <laughs> we'll see how it goes. We got to believe. Believe in the blue guy. Believe in the coldest guy, the coldest and bluest guy. Vegas, thanks for watching.